Hi, I'm Rob Collier. I'm with California Drivers Advocates, and today I'd like to discuss with you why the DMV suspends a person's driving privilege for financial responsibility and what the department's burden of proof is. In California, driving is a conditional privilege, meaning yes, the state will give you the privilege to drive, but you've got to follow the rules. You have to obey the rules of the road. You have to not drive while you're impaired. You have to register your car. And one of the most important ones is that when you drive on the road, if you're the owner or operator of a motor vehicle, you have to have proof of financial responsibility, essentially meaning your car has to have auto insurance. If you've been involved in a traffic collision, no matter who's at fault, and you do not have insurance, the DMV does have the privilege to suspend your driving privilege for one year based on that issue alone. Again, the cause of the accident is not an issue. The DMV's burden of proof is they have to prove that you were involved in a reportable accident. That means they have to prove that you were involved in a traffic collision uh, where there were either damages that exceed $1,000 or that somebody was injured, however slight. So a simple bloody nose is enough to fulfill that standard. So again, to reiterate, they have to prove that you were involved in a, re a reportable accident. And number two, they have to prove that your vehicle was not insured at the time. If they can prove those things, then the DMV is authorized by law to suspend your driver's license for one year. So that's their burden of proof. Uh, there are a lot of ways to fight it. There's a lot of way to win, win those hearings. So do your research, take a look at our website, or if you'd like more information, give us a call. We'll be happy to help.